Good morning, y'all, and welcome back to the Power of Nature radio show on Wild Out Radio. Happy Monday, y'all. I hope everyone had a very prosperous weekend. I hope everyone's weekend was lovely and prosperous like mine was because it always is just because I'm alive and I'm well and I'm able to come every Monday and still speak to y'all on Wild Out Radio. So y'all, this is Baltimore's reggae station for all your best reggae music y'all and not only that if you cannot listen locally you can go to the website www.wildlockradio.net and you can listen worldwide anytime that you would like and also if you do miss the power of nature show at any time you can always go to cleopatra's nature youtube channel because i do record all of the shows and put it on youtube so you all won't miss a thing so today I'm excited about my show, and the reason why I'm so happy about my show today because it is about the brain, y'all. So I'm excited about the brain. If you have been watching me for a while, you know I'm always talking about the brain and the benefits for the brain and the wonderful, wonderful herbs that I'm always consuming to help with my brain. So y'all, last week, I gave y'all a little rundown, a quick little rundown on the systems of the body. I mentioned the nervous system, so today we are talking about the nervous system, which is the system that holds our brain, our spinal cord, and our peripheral nerves or whatever. So, yes, and also our crown chakra as well is linked to our brain. Our crown chakra is linked to every chakra and every organ of the body. The crown chakra is our chakra of enlightenment and represents our connection to our life's purpose. So it is always, always a need for us to keep our brain strong at all times. So just to give y'all a little quick rundown, and I'm excited y'all because the reason why I'm talking about um, the nervous system, the brain and the herbs that I have because Cleopatra's Nature Jamaican Herbal Tea line is out and in full effect. You can order all of the herbs on Etsy. You can order through Instagram. You can order through the radio, wherever you would like. You can call me and order. Um, if you want to call me and order, that number is 202-344-6316. I will give you the number again later on in the show. But yes, Cleopatra's Nature Jamaican Herbal Tea line is in full effect. Right now, I have 43 different herbs that I'm using. I'm mixing and matching the tea bags. I'm also letting my customers customize their own type of tea bags. I'm putting the whole list out that I have, and any of my customers can just say, Hey, Cleopatra, I would like to customize me a tea bag with raw moon, sour orange, and Cersei. Can you make that for me? Yes, I can make that for you. I have you. So log on to my Instagram, log on to my Etsy store see all the herbs i am slowly putting stuff up i haven't put 100 percent everything up yet sorry y'all but i am putting everything up so y'all get back to the brain the brain is the most complex part of the human body literally it's the most complex part um it's a three pound organ and it's crazy that the brain is the most complex part of our body and it's only three pounds. Literally, this three pounds is so strong and doing everything. It's like the seat of intelligence. It's our interpreter of our senses. It's our initiator of body movement. It's our controller of our behaviors. Literally, the brain lies in its own little shell and is washed with protective fluid all day long over and over and over again. The protective fluid that it is being washed with is the cerebrospinal fluid, abbreviated as CSL fluid. Um, it is a watery fluid that continuously circulates through the brain's ventricles hollow cavities of the brain literally going through cleansing everything in the brain removing everything is cleaning all around the surface of the brain and our spinal cord it washes out like impurities from the brain it washes out um it basically transfers nutrients and provides a protective cushion into the brain and our spinal cord all day long, 24 hours. It never stopped flowing. It never stopped working just like our brain and the rest of our systems is always going at all times to keep our brain clean and refreshed. But literally our brain embodies the essence of our mind and our soul. Hence, going back to our root chakra, 
<laughs> it's all acting together, literally um, intelligence, creativity, emotion, memory, um, many things that is governed in our brain that's controlling our daily, daily everything about us, everything about that we do every day. So the brain does have three units, just to give a quick little review, three units, the forebrain, the midbrain, and the hindbrain. The hindbrain includes like the upper part of the spinal cord, the brain stem, and the wrinkled ball of tissue called the cerebellum. A lot of people probably know about the cerebellum. Um, and not only that, the hindbrain controls the body's vital functioning such as our respiration, our heart rate. And then we got the cerebellum that coordinates our movement. The uppermost part of the brainstem is the midbrain. The midbrain controls our reflexes, our actions, and a part of our circuit involvement in the control of eye movements and voluntary movements. So the forebrain is the largest and most highly developed part of the human brain primarily because it consists of our cerebrum so and it's the structures and the structures that's hidden beneath it literally sits at the topmost part of the brain and it's the source of our intellectual activities y'all so literally it's very important for us to eat the things that we need to eat drink the fluids basically like basically drinking enough water staying hydrated because if our brain malfunctions everything in our body is going to malfunction once our brain malfunctions um it literally holds our memories it allows us to plan it enables our imagination. It enables us to be able to think. It allows us to recognize our friends. It allows us to read books, play games. Literally, the cerebrum is split into two hemispheres. The ability to form words seems to lie primarily in the left hemisphere, while in the right hemisphere, is like controlling our abstract reasoning. So again, everything in our body is functioning and forming together properly for its own purposes. So um, each hemisphere is divided into sections called lobes. We know the two front lobes is called the frontal lobes. They lie directly behind our, for our forehead. They control motor skills and thoughts. The two sections behind the frontal lobe is called the perianal lobes. They control our senses. Um, the optical lobe is the area at the back of the brain controlling our vision. Any damage to the optical lobe can cause blindness, y'all. So just be careful with banging your head, falling back, that kind of stuff, because we don't want to damage anything in our brain to not make us be able to form and function properly. So just to get to the couple of herbs that I do have, for the brain and the brain function. One of my favorites, I'm always talking about rosemary. Everybody know how much I love rosemary. Literally, I go to rosemary every day is one of my go-tos. It always have been way when I first started my herbal journey because rosemary was one of the things that I was consuming that literally helped me lower my high blood pressure and literally maintain it throughout the day. And then not only that, like um, if I'm going to do a whole bunch of studying, like a lot of late nights, I open up all my books and I sit there and I study, study, study. So before I start studying, I always go to rosemary tea. I always make me some rosemary. Even um, with like using rosemary as a tobacco substitute, using it as like a grass rosemary is very good when you are smoking to use it as a tobacco substitute it really does good um and not only that rosemary gets into our body it fights on all of these wonderful things that is from nature so yes i'm happy y'all i did get the video back up so just to reiterate reiterate again for the video purposes Pimento is what I'm talking about. Pimento protects our brain functioning as one ages to prevent cognitive decline. So um, I really love this. I promote this a lot to both of my grandmothers because one of my grandmothers are still up. She's You can't tell her to sit down. You can't tell her to stop driving. You can't tell her to stop moving. She's very independent. She live alone and do everything it is that she wants to do. So I'm always promoting rosemary, pimento, and different things for her. Um, I love the fact that she's crazy about fever grass. She's crazy about avocado leaves. She loves it. Um, so yeah, it's like, y'all, 
don't be afraid to let y'all grandmothers know just because they're your grandmothers and they're older, your parents, your great aunties and uncles and everybody, because although we're the generation coming behind us, behind them, they do listen to us. They do value our opinion and they respect what we have to say. So y'all share the knowledge and the information with your elders, because, you know, the problem is we're just with in America, we're ignorant to a lot of these things because we wasn't taught. We just don't know. We don't know about different fruits. We don't know about herbs. We don't know about vegetables. So don't be afraid to, you know, tell the elders and your family because they will listen. Trust me, my grandmothers call me on video all the time asking me different questions. And I really value that they listen and they're actually taking in and using what I'm giving for them. So the next thing that I do want to talk about is avocado avocado is one of my favorites like i said it's my grandmother's one of my grandmother's favorites she really does love avocado leaf tea um avocado itself helps with cognitive decline it enhances memory and problem solving now avocado is called pear before somebody correct me because i know it's a jamaican right now listening to my pear <laughs> So, yes, yeah, so avocado and pear is considered the same thing in the Caribbean, y'all. So, avocado is everybody's favorite. They eat it, you know what I'm saying, like they eat an apple. I've seen people just, like, take some and just spread it on bread and just eat it just like that. I've seen music shun, like, take some avocado and peanut butter and eat it just like that. So, um, avocado is really good. Cognitive decline enhances memory and problem solving. Now, if you remember back to the beginning of the video when we talked about all the different parts of the brain and what the different parts of the brain was controlling and doing for our senses, our cognitive delay, and our vision. So all of these herbs are tying in with the different parts of our brain and what it's doing to keep our brain functioning properly. Um, the next thing is moringa. Everybody knows I love moringa. I rave about moringa all the time moringa is good for our brain for one because it helps with alzheimer's disease it helps with our cognitive decline it helps with um keeping our brain young so it doesn't age with us as we grow moringa is just 100 percent all around my baby I love moringa. Like, I love it. Um, even, you know, Ludi Boss told me about moringa before when he was, you know, took the moringa seed and used it just like a um, a sexual stimulant and it worked well. And he gave the seed to his girlfriend and it got rid of her headache. Like, y'all, moringa is all around just wonderful. It literally is. It helps with a lot. And even like for our skin, I do have a Moringa skin oil that and I have it on my face right now. That's why my face always has like this little glow to it Um, because I literally utilize Moringa. I love how I feel on my skin. I love the protective barrier that it gives my skin, protecting me from the free radicals in the dirt, the particles that's flying around outside. So I'm really pumped about the Moringa oil. So you can also get that on my Etsy store because I do love Moringa and every Everything about it. Um, the next thing that I'm always raving about too is Noonie. Noonie, Noonie leaf tea, Noonie juice itself. And you can also eat Noonie raw as well. Um, Noonie encourages cerebral blood flow to boost brain memory, y'all. I'm going to say that again about Noonie. Noonie, Noonie encourages cerebral blood flow to boost memory. Now, y'all, Noonie is not something that tastes well. It's black. It sits for a long time to, you know, come through the little stage to get strong and do everything that it needs to do to extract all of its wonderful, wonderful benefits. But I'm telling y'all, Noonie, our body dances, our intestine dances when we take a shot of Noonie. Because all you need is a little shot, like literally how I do my pour it in a little shot cup. And I just take me a little shot for real, maybe a tablespoon full. Um, if we're going into measurements, maybe just a tablespoon a day, drink some water behind it. The energy that it gives me, it does give me clear thoughts. 
and boost my memory, boost everything about it or whatever. So I love Noonie as well. So y'all, I think I did do a video on Noonie too. So y'all can check my YouTube channel and go back to Noonie so y'all can actually see the Noonie actually green on the tree before it actually gets picked. And then like how they put it in a bucket and just literally let it sit. They don't do anything extra to it. They just put it in a bucket and let it sit for however long it takes to extract all the fluid out of all of them that's in the bucket. Um so yeah y'all that's noony i love noony and everything about noony and not only that music sean is the noony man in his neighborhood he has tons of um noony trees in his yard so y'all don't be shy go to my Etsy store i do have noony leaves so you can do noony leaf tea i do have a very very small limited supply of noony juice but i do have some noony juice available straight from saint mary jamaica made by music shine as well um and not on that my next thing is trumpet tree i really love trumpet tree just because i like how the leaves of the trumpet tree look on the leaves i like how big they are they're literally like a little umbrella that keeps you shaded in the summertime and not only that it treats parkinson's disease so Again, y'all, for all of my Caribbeans out there that's in Jamaica and you suffering with some brain illnesses and Parkinson's disease and you shaking and all kind of stuff and you can't figure why your hands keep shaking and why you can't stay focused, go out there and get you some trumpet tree because trumpet tree is literally curing Parkinson's disease and all of the um, conditions that cause it. And last but not least, Vervine. I love Vervine, for one, because Vervine right now is curing the coronavirus in Jamaica. And two, Vervine works with all 12 systems of our body. Literally, all 12 systems of our body has a positive effect when it comes to Vervine and what it's doing. So when it comes to our brain health and our eyes with Vervine, it literally improves our nervous system. It improves all parts of the brain functioning literally all parts of our brain vervine is increasing and boosting and making our brain wonderful so y'all these are the herbs that i have for brain health today rosemary pimento avocado moringa nuni trumpet tree and vervine so all of these herbs are like doing stuff fighting our free radicals to boost our brain memory um, helping with our performance, accuracy, protecting our brain from aging, our cognitive decline is preventing that, it's enhancing memory and problem solving, Alzheimer's disease, Parkinson's, encouraging cerebral blood flow, and improving the nervous system within itself, making it stronger and keeping it strong. So these are the herbs from Cleopatra's Nature Jamaican Herbal Tea Line. You can always order these herbs via Instagram on Cleopatra's Nature. You can always go to Etsy.com, search Cleopatra's Nature. I have a whole store. I think I have about 20 something items on there right now. So just go to the Etsy store, check it out. See if there's something natural from nature that is calling your name, that is calling your immune system because I have tons of natural things for everybody. Literally a calabash of tea a day will keep the toxins away. I promote pure earth for power because I love nature nature created everything it is that we need to be the best versions of ourselves so y'all this is cleopatra's nature the power of nature show on wild out radio always tune in to wild out radio 24 7 because the radio station never sleeps 24 hours a day there is good good music on here music that you're not gonna hear on no other station in maryland well i ain't gonna say maryland no other station in baltimore i guess this is baltimore's reggae station so tune in to wild out radio www.wildoutradio.net also if you would like to call in you don't have um access to a computer you don't have access to be able to go to the website but you want to order some products you got a question you want to get a calabash you want to get some chocolate just call me 202-344-6316 and again y'all thank y'all for tuning in to the power of nature and i will see y'all next monday